Hello, everybody. Hey, no, I'm not in the jungles with Myanmar. You know, I haven't been able to be there in uh, quite a while due to the uh, incredible upheaval in the government there with the Civil War and with COVID and everything. Um, I'm just here in my yard in a place that's really, really bright and sunny out, and I had to find some place with uh, natural light but some shade. Um, this is pretty much an all call to those who know Pastor Nang Tong. Um, and those who've been supporting him and loving him and being a part of his journey for a long time. We are calling on everyone who has been praying for and supporting the work in Myanmar and who loves Pastor Nang Tong to consider helping us right now meet a critical and urgent need. Uh, many of you may have seen that we've been working for years to put together a uh, self-sustaining business in the area. We were building a stadium you may not have even heard, but the stadium was destroyed in a storm. So you got COVID, you've got civil war, and now we have a storm destroying uh, Pastor Nang's stadium called Canaan Stadium that he had hoped would be an outreach and a way to make money. Um, we really need some help today. We're not going to build the stadium right now. We've seen that God has obviously had other plans for us. So we've diverted uh, the salvage from the stadium to building homes of the people that have been destroyed uh, in the Civil War. and um, But we need to purchase some land. And Pastor Nang has even sold some of his property back in Chin State to try to make this happen. There's a rare opportunity to get uh, some land for a discounted price that is gonna help the future of this ministry. We have been working for years to try to move the orphans from where they are in Rakhine closer to where Pastor Nang's house is. Uh, and there is an opportunity that has made itself available to us right now. Um, and we can get some land at reduced cost. This is kind of an urgent, timely need. If we can put together some money this week and make this purchase, uh, it's going to benefit the ministry and the orphanage for many years to come.